head coach Mike McConathy, a victory against champion Christian on Sunday. And coach, uh, this game, one of those, you know, after a break kind of things, you wanted to build on the momentum against Lamar. It uh, looks like you guys did that pretty well today. We did. Well, unfortunately, we turned the ball all over a lot of times, and uh, some of it was hustle stuff. Some of it was just not being aggressive and stepping and meeting passes or being tough with the ball. The other thing, you got to give champions – a lot of credit every time we rebound the ball, you got to be strong with it because they're coming trying to get it because that's sometimes the best defense that you can get is the prize defense there, and they did a nice job with that. We had, we had probably three or four walking violations, so we go through the first part of the season where they call it, and then it doesn't get called. Now it's being called again, which I don't have a problem with that. And I talked to the officials about that. You know, you call when they walk, they got to make sure their feet are set and they need to do what they're supposed to. But I thought it was positive things. I thought we shot the ball well from the three point line, 46 points in the paint, out rebound by 20, and we were supposed to. But the one thing that was a positive thing was in the first half, we mixed our zones up, created some problems. In the second half, we primarily played man to man until the better, better end and allowed us to guard smaller people on the perimeter. Uh, which we're going to be playing big, bigger people come next Thursday night against Corpus Christi, who runs a, a five-man motion on the outside that will create problems for us. But I thought we did a good job with that. Sometimes the hardest things to do are to do what you're supposed to in a game like this, where you're supposed to out-rebound a team, where you're supposed to dominate them in the paint. To do this, you're able to continue your momentum, but also you got a good game from Larry Owens, which I know that was nice to see. And then Robert Hugas there at the end, uh, that was some fun to see him come off and really maybe start to feel like he's a part of this. Well, Robert is a great young man, and every player on this team loves Robert. For him to hit the two back-to-back -back threes and get the dunk that led into it and got a little bit excited, but, you know, did some really nice things. I mean, he really understands the game and passes it well. It's just, you know, it's just it's just taking him time to learn a defensive concept and do the things he needs to, but a great young man, and, you know, it was great to see him have some good quality minutes. Larry Owens inside, 11 rebounds. You mentioned the importance of rebounding against a team like this, and for him to answer the bell, a confidence builder for him. Yeah, no doubt about it. And the other thing is Larry played right at 20 minutes, and that gave him a little bit of more work, uh, trying to get him get himself, get his heart rate up a little bit. Jamari Gregg played about 18, 19 minutes. Condition-wise, basically he was down for 14 days, and then you know, we practice three days, then we, we, we're, we play, and then he's – He's, he's off for four days, so he, he was a little bit leg weary, but I think he'll be fine. Good job by the team. Keep the uh, the mental sharpness through the break. Yeah, I thought the, we came through it, and, you know, it was great to get the win against Lamar and come back today and get that one. I'm just uh, grateful for that. Got to continue to work on the little things to improve, and we got to do that these next uh, couple of days as we prepare for our game on Thursday. All right. Thanks, Coach.